Hey guys, how goes it? So uh, here's the new project I'm working on. Uh, I got a customer who came to me and he wants uh, the back of that uh, set up as a really cool wall mount uh, with some LEDs in it and a little storage compartment and stuff like that. Uh, but first, I need to get my garage cleaned up because I have still yet to unpack all the tools from the No Name Nationals race that we went to. So let's get the garage cleaned up first. I'm not going to bore you guys with that, but I'm going to get that done real quick. Like... Alright guys, so uh, day one of uh, getting this prepped and stuff is uh, is done. Um, I've got all of the excess weight out of it that we're pretty much going to do. Now all that's left is going through and uh, hitting some of the, all the sharp edges and grinding those little parts and stuff down to make it safe to handle and stuff like that. But I feel like we have enough weight taken out of it now uh, and we've left enough uh, We've left enough material in it to help keep it structurally sound. And of course, I'm gonna be making an aluminum frame to mount this on the wall, so like that's not a huge problem. But we definitely took a lot of unnecessary weight out of it. So next to be getting all that cleaned up, making measurements and stuff for our framing. Here's what I've got done so far. I've got everything trimmed out and uh, all the excess weight and stuff trimmed out of it. We're gonna be putting LEDs and the tail lights so that way when he flips the switch uh, the tail lights light up uh, I just finished cutting out this big chunk of aluminum right here this is going to be the main uh, brace it's going to be like what i'm going to mount to this 
I've got a French cleat uh, hanging set up here. I'm gonna get that drilled in place, and this is how we're actually gonna like hang it on the wall itself. Um, this, it's really funny too because these these look flimsy, um, but these will hold up to like 350 pounds. So because uh, of the way they're designed. So this will be how we mount it to the walls. All right, so of course I ground the edges down and then I put this nice rubber trim all the way around. Not only does that look really nice, uh, but that helps uh, keep the edges and stuff clean. Um, and of course when it mounts against the wall, it'll have this little rubber buffer. It should look really good. Got the bumper and everything. So yeah, that's where we're at so far. So uh, let's continue to work on this and see how it goes. All right, guys, here's what I have so far. I've got the main bracing mocked up and uh, ready to be like completely bolted in place and set up. Uh, I've got a little bit of trimming to do right here. That's, that's not quite lined up, so I'll get that trimmed up and lined up nice. Uh, make the hinges for the trunk and then run the LEDs and such on the inside. And then this will be ready to go to the customer and mount it on their wall. Hope you enjoyed the video. See you later.